Fortnite is dying. That's all. It's all over, guys. Why hello everybody, welcome to my new video, Fortnite is dying, that's all, it's all over guys, it's all over, Fortnite is dying, let's prepare ourselves, let's collect some money for the flowers, for the grave, for everything else that goes with that, Fortnite is dying, it's all over, <sighs> is it really? Now for the past two months, I've been playing Fortnite on my channel and I've been receiving a lot of comments like, why do you play this game? Why do you play the game what's dying? The game is dying, why do you play it? I play it because I like it. I play it because I love it. I play it because I want to get better at it. I play it because I just wanna play it. You know, like, you know when you wanna do something, you know when you like pancakes and you want to make pancakes, you know when you like pizza, you want to make pizza, you know? You know when you like to hang out with your friends to watch World Cup FIFA in the Russia and you just you know have the big TV, you order some food, some drink and you just chill out because you like that. And that's why I like playing Fortnite. Now today we're gonna go through many stuff dudes, through many. This is something that I wanna speak my mind. As always, I always encourage you guys to speak your mind, you know. But at least what we should try to do more is to speak free, but not to speak so much in the negative way. It will only affect our results, okay? It's like we should speak free, but we should also say it in the way that gives us a result, that wakes some good emotion inside us. You know when you get negative emotion, it's not gonna work, okay? With the positive ones, with the strong ones, we can do, we can get the job done. So, today I will tell you one thing, is Fortnite dying or not? You guys gave me the idea, so let's see, is Fortnite dying or not? Okay, so Fortnite is all over the internet and there has been some moments where so many updates went outside and people were on one side happy about and the second skeptical. It's totally normal, sometimes it's okay to be optimistical, sometimes no, it's never okay to be pessimistical, but, but sometimes it's okay to be skeptical, but not for too much, not for too much, okay? So, what happened? So many news and updates came in the Fortnite. Some mosquito is biting my back. Screw him. <laughs> so, some so new updates came out and people were thinking this will ruin the game. That will ruin the game. No, this will ruin the game. And that didn't happen. Why? Epic Games sometimes from time to time listen to their audience, listen to feedback and we as a community can help this. Because we are giving the feedback and as I said, with our good intention. Because with all the hate, with all the negative feelings, you know that sometimes we feel that that will solve the problem. But at the end of the day, it never solves the problem. Very often it becomes even worse. So with our good intention, there was the times where they really listened to feedback and they removed the jetpack or something similar or some weapons that they found not acceptable anymore in the Fortnite community. So, every single time the new update comes, there are always comments down below like, this will ruin the game, now it's all over. Prepare the flowers, prepare the shit, prepare everything else because this son of a bitch is gonna die. But that never happened, now why? But out of all games, Epic Games are trying their best to release new updates to work on the game to constantly update the freaking game so they can actually make the game active so people will always have a reason to return you know so we can always play and at the, at the end of the day what we want is to have fun you know like screw the negativity screw everything else like we want to have fun guys that's the most thing in life what set us free is having fun feeling good about ourselves so 
What I like is I I agree with that. I support that. Like something what we really need is when some company really cares. So that's one of the reasons why Fortnite is not dying. Second reason is did you see Kim Star's Fortnite tournaments? Now not only that those tournaments are every Friday, but but Kim Star made them to be really nice. You know, and what I like is so many people are not only connecting their audiences together, but so many streamers are talking to each other, having a great time, and at the end of the day, that's what keeps us going, okay? That's what feels us, oh, I cannot wait for the next day to come, right? To the next Friday or something. So, so many, $20,000 are invested in those tournaments every single time, and that's one of the reasons why it's far away from dying. Another reason is, did you see that Fortnite is organizing like a, let's call it World Cup tournament, like they put 100 freaking fucking million dollars in the tournament can you imagine what big amount of money is that so the son of a bitch is never gonna die and that's good so 100 million dollars i don't remember any game doing those such of things like investing 100 million dollars that they will you know separate between all tournaments and something like that so that's already a reason why this game is far away from dying okay the mosquito fucking go out of the window that's good so that's uh, one of the reasons why Fortnite is not dying. Those are already three reasons why we are keeping this game alive and it's far away from dying and Fortnite is getting every single time more and more active players, over 1 million users, so many people and this game is growing and at the end of the day you got the battle pass coming in 19 days so this game is constantly updating every single time and now if you just go on the Twitter that's where all the people are when something is about to happen now did i forget to say yes i did i blame mosquito for that shit so uh, i forgot to say fortnite came on nintendo switch even there okay it came the last the last it comes on nintendo switch but at least it came okay so one of the reasons phone not now so so even came on the Nintendo Switch on the mobile long time ago, Fortnite is all over and how can a game that's free die? How can a game, excuse me, English is not my first language, but if I am not saying something right, teacher, I'm fucking ready for the next lesson, write it down below, I will teach it as soon as possible, I'm gonna learn it. Anyways, Fortnite, how can one game die? How can a game die if it is free? It's not if it is free, if it is updating, having so many tournaments, having so many investments by the company, how? Fortnite is far away from dying. And this, if you see Fortnite on Twitch, on YouTube, if you see the live streams, there are so many active people over there, so many, so many. For example, I watch Nikkei 30 and, and do you see how many people are watching those good streams? On Twitch, if you go see other streamers, Twitch streamers, Ninja, Meet, everybody else, like I watch Cypher. If you watch those people, you can see so many people always active, always active. So everything is in the circle, so I don't see how this game can die any soon. It, it's gonna be here this year, next year, after 2020. I don't know when it's gonna die, but it's not gonna come soon. And whatever people say, some, some, some people, whatever some people say, is it gonna die? No, it's not gonna die and I like to play it. And that's all. I just like to play it. I just wanna become a better player. Okay, I wanna become better. I wanna become, I wanna share my great moments. I wanna share my positive energy, my kind of positive energy with all the people. I wanna share something that makes me feel good about it. So at the end of the day, you can feel good as well. If you are already feeling, that's great, but for example, if you are not feeling, I want to do my best at least when you are on my channel to watch something so you can feel good about it. So you can really feel good about it. So something will tickle, tickle your heart and say, yes, I feel good about it. I can feel good about it. So that's all. So is it Fortnite dying? No. Just go over here, see, new, they are even returning some skins. They are even, oh, 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 like, like she got that. 
nobody farted, okay? So <laughs> the sting bomb, the shit bomb, excuse me, the sting bomb. Okay, the sting bomb actually uh, this video reminds me, I don't know when I watch it. Look. She has that face impression like somebody farted like What did we <laughs> Like like what the fuck? Okay, so that's all for today guys so many you see this ninja from the save of the save the world they even make a crying emote I even crying emote they make guys so this game is constantly updating constantly and I'm doing my best to play it I'm doing my best to master it so I can make some great content for you guys so you can have something great to watch while you are on my channel and uh, thank you very much for watching final conclusion of this is no dying. I'm no I'm not ready to buy any flower shit to go on the grave. I don't want I don't like to do that. Who likes that? I don't want. I'm not planning to do. It's over. So, thank you for watching. Subscribe to my channel. I'm Symbiot. At the end of the day, let's try to do something we love. Better to if you if you think about failure, well, instead of failing at something that you don't like, why not at least try in something you like? You understand? Many people are there who are failing in something that they don't like. Well, at least if you are about to fail, at least try with something you love. Maybe something good will happen. Maybe you will succeed. Thank you for watching. You're welcome for this video. I will see you all in my next one. And new updates are coming on the channel soon very big announcement changes are coming to my channel and updates we're gonna have rules on the channel very nice rules so we can make this place a better place you're welcome for this video high five